Hey everyone, today Priyanka Bose and I pay tribute to the original diva of Indian cinema, the glamorous, super glamorous Rekha. So for this look, here we go. This is a very, very light foundation. Buff that into the skin. It's a perfect shade. For this beautiful exotic skin like Priyanka's. Um, this is by Becca in the shade Coffee. So, and like I say, blend, 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 blend is your friend. So I'm, I'm using Bobbi Brown Sheer Finish Loose Powder in the shade Sunny Beige on number two. Quickly adding some contour and shadow to Priyanka's face. I'm going to go into the temples, which is this area and the perimeter, the forehead, with that same bronzer. So we have a nice graduation of color. It looks like the skin is really stretched tight over the bone. Going in with a blush by NARS, they always name their products with a bit of a naughty twist. Mm. This one's uh, called Orgasm. Mm. It's a beautiful pink with a gold shimmer in it. So on the apples of the cheek, onto the cheekbone. For eyeshadow, I'm going in with this beautiful little notebook by Sephora that I found many years ago. Uh, this is called Baked Color Notebook. It's got beautiful colors. Pick the gold, dust off the excess. Deposit the product on the middle of the eye, right there. So I'm just playing a little bit there, up and down, up and down, back and forth. And then blending that product to the sides of the eye. Next, with the same brush, I'm going into the deeper, deeper, uh, this reddish brownish shade. With the same. You see this crease here? So we're going to deposit the product with the brush there. So that's the first point of contact. We blend, 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 blend over here on the outside, and then move inward. And when you reach the outer corner of the eye here, we want to make sure we give it some upward strokes. So it blends with the brow bone. Now, Rekha is the pioneer over here with this, this product. She's, she's always lined her, the inner waterline, which is that bit of the eye, with a white or an off-white liner. Um, it makes the eyes appear bigger. It really works with this look. This is by Inglo. And I'm not too fond of the white because it can look really stark. So I'm going in with this little slightly creamish. There you go. That's the pencil. So on the waterline here. So start in the middle. Just like you put kajal, it's just a regular eyeliner. There we go, that's how black it is. All right, I'm going to line the upper eyelid. So just roughly, you don't need to be too precise because I'm going to smudge it out later. Imagine there's a line from the nose to the eye. That's your imaginary line, right? So you want to follow that curve. So literally, when you come here, you flick it up there, you see? And then with your finger, you can just pull it out. Easy. So we line the eyelid. This is fairly simple to do. And then you flick that up. And with your finger, give it a pull. Right? So we start on the outside. Below the hair. We stop there. Going in with my lovely Smashbox palette. I'm going to pick this, well, any black eyeshadow will do. So I'm just, this is a brush again by Sephora. It's an angular brush. You get angular brushes everywhere. Take any black eyeshadow. Don't overload the brush. Right? I'm going to take this product and literally buff it into this liner. So please. So here, buff, 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 and go in. Start on the outside always, because that's where you want to deposit the most product and work inward. Never start on the inside. You'll get too much product on the inside. This is a retractable pencil. Rekha loves to draw lines, which I personally love too. Lines in the eyebrow, so it looks like real hair sprouting out of the skin. So that's what we're going to do. 
and quite starkly so. So just one, two, three, four, five. Once we caught a fish alive. <laughs> right, so you can go over it if you want it darker. Can you look at that? It's beautiful the way it looks like natural hair. Again, one, two, three, four, five, one, two. Rekha's eyebrows over here are quite stark and solid. So I'm using Makeup Forever Aqua Brow in the shade 40. It comes with its own little brush, so I like it. Taking some of this product, right? And literally filling in the eyebrow there. This has always been my favorite feature of the face. So I'm gonna go in quite strong with the eyebrows because we want diva. Next one. You see how I haven't disturbed those initial few lines? I've only, but I've, I've easily blended it into there, but I've not disturbed those lines. Okay, so, okay, I know, I know, I know, I know, not all of you have access to eyelashes and that's fine. I mean, Priyanka does look beautiful as is. All you need is a little lot, I mean, maybe two coats of mascara, but this is also a tutorial for makeup artists out there. So we are going to use the lashes by Euro Paris in number 61. They're dense on the outside and then they thin out towards the inside. I'm going to literally just stick that to her lash line. Hold both the ends down. That's like va va voom. <laughs> Lashes. <laughs> now the other. For luscious, luscious Rekha's overdrawn lip. She's, you can, you can see in the image that's attached. Um, she really draws way outside her own lips. Priyanka, thankfully, does have full lips, so we may not need to go that much on the outside, but just to show you, just relax the mouth. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to press the side of the mouth here. This is for the makeup artist. Press the side of the mouth so that that part of the lip really jumps out, and then you want to draw a line there. So I, I have overdrawn ever so slightly around her mouth, but not too much and then follow that line through into her own lip. Right? Did you guys know that Rekha really does all her own makeup? She's always done her own makeup and everything she's done. She's fantastic. This way, yeah. So I'm gonna press here so we see the lip jump out. And go in with the liner brush, I mean the liner pencil, and follow it through into her own lip. The same way on the lower lip. I'm going to fill in the lip with this color. Oh, this is by Bourjois. I love Bourjois pencils. Lip liner in the shade Brun. Number 21, Brun. Over the lip liner, I'm using a lipstick. You don't need to use a lipstick. You can directly use a gloss or go out just like that. But for demo purposes, this is a lipstick by Chanel in the number 207 and the name is Famous. Don't we all want to be famous? So, smile please. Just going over that with this beautiful lipstick. We're going to go in with a gloss over that. Uh, this is by Giordani. I don't even know where I found this. It was a gift by my cosmetologist. <laughs> Actually, she just gifted me a bag of makeup. Yeah. So this is a nice red gloss. I'll show you how red it is. Look at that. It's mm. quite red. I want just a hint of this gloss. Smile. There we go. Just to make the lips appear fuller. Nam, nam, nam. Finally, I'm going to powder Priyanka's face a little bit. The bridge of the nose. Forehead. Chin. Okay. Guys, I forgot the main ingredient for Rekha's look, which is her tikka, her mole on the upper side of her lip. Um, 
So I'm gonna take a liquid liner. This is Lacme's absolute liquid liner. Literally just put one little dot there. Now that's the future diva of Indian cinema. <laughs> Thank you for watching.